New adventure, we go from Airbnb point A to Airbnb point. B. B. Can we make it? Hell yeah, we can. This was my nice Airbnb the last week, last day of Pretoria. Very nice, very, very nice. And off we go to Japan. Okay guys, now next adventure. We'll be on a plane tomorrow to go to Japan. I'm doing this weird angle. This is Airbnb, really nice. I really recommend it. The balcony, the table, nice garden, you can bry. Rice barbecue here in South Africa. That bench, which I am going to use, just to reflect a little bit about our adventure. I should be contacting Airbnb to uh, have them sponsor me or something. I mean, I've rented everywhere, bro. Croatia, Italy, Japan, South Africa, Mexico. I've been everywhere, bro. Uh, Airbnb, you rock. I stayed in South Africa for six months visiting my son and going to court. It was a very difficult and excruciating experience for me, mixed with both emotions of happiness and joy by being with my son, but also sadness and just pain. So I was happy to take a break. On to our next new adventure. Oh no, here we go. So it starts. Could it be true? Am I escaping? Escaping? Yes, I am. Fuck South Africa. With a big fucking smile. During my time in South Africa, I went to court on a total of five or six times. And uh, it left me drained. What you're listening to is my band Slid Wrist. The song is Died in Pain from the new EP Hotel Hell. Make sure to check it out and support me by accessing my store and buying some merchandise as well, my friends. I can't really believe that I caught some bad karma in South Africa. And of course, my screen was the only one that wasn't working properly. Throughout 20 hours! My experience this year in South Africa has to be the worst experience I've ever lived in my entire life. I don't wish it to my worst enemy. I would rather kill myself than leave what I lived during those six months again. And I mean it. So I was so happy to be on that plane and leaving the hell out of that place. my neighbor was constantly coughing and then the, the guy behind me and the guy on the right side behind me as well and it turned into a nightmare and now I'm worried that I have COVID
I totally forgot that I had to do two transfers. So when I thought I was arriving to Japan, I was actually arriving to another place. I was left in two days. And finally, after two days of traveling, If you want to know more about my music and my art career, make sure to check out my new podcast coming up in a couple of weeks. You'll be out everywhere. Japan. I'm not <laughs> Japan has been in my book at least for decades. I never really thought I was going to make it here, and I've been wanting to visit it for so long. And now that I'm here, I'm gonna raise some serious hell, my friends, and I will take you with me. I hope you enjoy my new vlog series and consider supporting my Patreon and donating so I can keep living the dream and showing you this amazing place. This is my view, fifth floor, my Airbnb. This is Kamagaya City. And this is my meal. And this is where I'm gonna sit. There's a table down there, but I like this. I don't know. This is way better. Oh, by the way, you cannot wear shoes inside. And they give you these nice um, alcohol napkins. Wash your hands. And I got this beautiful meat and some more stuff. This is one of the orange teas. I've never tried it, I don't really like tea, but... And this is for my hangover that I got in the gym down there. And it's been gloomy, doomy, gray, as I like it. Yeah, there you go, my friends. Japan. Tomorrow we'll go to a flea market to get Lots of uh, electronics that I need, I need a new phone. Remember my friends, join my Patreon, subscribe to my YouTube channel. For exclusive content, this is the Patreon, and YouTube channel is like, I'm gonna be releasing these videos. This is my first day in Japan, not even 72 hours here. And I'm feeling it, boy. Yeah! Like it.